Um, you know, back in those early days when everybody was doing the same thing, you know, it was it started to become a race to get ahead of everybody. And we had started off pretty far ahead with our automation and the way we were thinking. Um, the next thing we need to do is start to understand what Google was looking for. Why do they rank these sites number one? And so um, we built a, a software, an algorithm detection system or a ranking detection system that allows us to really understand what things everybody has in common to make it to these certain positions. Um, mm, okay, I see. So yeah, it's, like common traits about people getting getting positions and ranks. Exactly. And so, I mean, for example, if, if, you know, if you describe something on your website, such as a, a plumbing repair, and you have 1,500 words to describe it, but everybody else can describe it in 300 words, you might be a little bit too wordy. And that stuff, starting to, that stuff starts to become pretty easy to see once you start looking for it. So Google cares about the quantity of words or is it, is it about how, how effectively you're communicating with? It's about effective communication. Yeah. It's, it's allowing, it's allowing um, a high level of comprehension for Google's consumer. You know, if they go online and they're looking for something specific and you start swaying way outside of, of the realm of what they're looking for, right. it's confusing. And Google doesn't know if they're do, sending the customer to the right page. Things,